and we start with uh, Sefer Shmiras Lashon. And it says the habitual speaker of Loshan Hara. That's a, that's a bad person, right? The primary prohibition against speaking Loshan Hara is that do not go as a gossiper among your people. It says in Vaikra 1916. However, the Hafiz Khan demonstrates that the sin can involve the transgression of numerous positive and negative commandments. The Baal Loshan Hara, habitual speaker of Loshan Hara, can easily accumulate a um, multitude of transgressions at the rate unparalleled to any other thing. As we said uh, before, or we did not say, um, the study of the Torah encompasses like, or it's like a comparable to all of the mitzvahs combined, and the specific of the Shonhara is com com combination of all of other sins. That's how severe it is. Um, that is why the sages say that the speaking of Lashon Hara is the worst than even the worst of the severe sins. That's that's what they say, right? Plus, if you if you just think logically, how often you do, you do other other sins? Not not often, when uh, well, right? Uh, but uh, Lashon Hara could be every every second, every minute, every hour of person's life. We all communicate and. Uh, very possible that uh, people say Russian Hara. Furthermore, it is virtually impossible for a habitual speaker to ask forgiveness of everyone who was affected by his sinful speech. So that's, uh, that's another big thing, right? So for example, if somebody did the uh, sin, so it's uh, very possible for him to do the shua. Whatever is it, uh, maybe he, he wronged his fellow, he can go back and offer him money, apology, he can pray. Uh, all right, and all other things. So, okay, he can do the sure. But when he speaks every day about other people, go find all the other people that he spoke about and uh, go try to fix the damage. It's almost uh, mission impossible. Thus, uh, uh, he, uh, he will find it difficult, if not uh, impossible, to achieve full repentance for the sins. The sages caution us to avoid the associated with the Baal Loshan Hara, and not to live in the vicinity of such people. So not, not to live, maybe it's not always our choice, but at least to avoid the company, it's for sure our choice. So you can say, you know, I, I'm, in, I'm in a rush, I have to go this way, that way. So don't, uh, don't uh, just, if you need to say hello, say hello, but continue, continue walking. All right, so we're going to stop here.